Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. The coronavirus has taken over the news, social media, and most of our conversations. Even Google has added coronavirus safety tips to its homepage to deliver coronavirus-related info to the masses. Today, we have tips from one of our favorite doctors, physicians, Dr. Dave. And we're going to run it down. All right. All right, well, let's first. get on into it. Dr. Dave says to clean every surface that touches your hands with household cleaners like Lysol, bleach, or other other um, other substances that have at least 70% ethanol alcohol in mm -hmm. it. And Ooh. it's an added bonus to clean it twice a day. I've been trying to do this. I have a can of Lysol down to my purse right now. Mm -hmm. The unfortunate thing is like when you go to the stores though, they're sold out everywhere. So yeah. at least you could use, you could probably do the bleach or in the and alcohol, water and the alcohol. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's in full supply. Mm -hmm. That's yep. in full supply. You can make a spray bottle out of it too. Uh -huh. yes. That's what we did all weekend. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Another tip from Dr. Dave. The good doc. Yes, he says wash your hands properly and frequently. Well, Trina does this anyway. And yes, yes, yes. <laughs> he suggests that you wash your hands like a surgeon would, mm -hmm. starting with the tips. Oh. Starting with the tips and then washing the rest of your hands with, you know, soap and water. Uh -huh. And when you rinse them, rinse them tips up. Ah. And then so the water down. drains down yeah. and use a clean towel. But of course, they're using disposable oh, towels. We're like not doing right. that. but. You know, try to make sure it's, a, it's a clean like towel. This. I, I, I mm -hmm. use paper towels. Yeah, we use paper lot. towels too. A lot. So. All right, keeping the, uh, the the theme of the surgeons, Dr. Dave said, <laughs> wear your nails, ladies mm. and gentlemen, as short as surgeons would. Just and so on. that's not showing on. too much of uh, the free edge. You're not having a lot of free mm -hmm. edges. Like this is probably way too much free edge. Mm -hmm. And that's the, the nail, that the length of the nail. It should be uh, right at your hyponepium. That's where it should be. Oh, my hyponepium! <laughs> what, 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 well, you know, I went to... Oh, I know, I know. I know again. Hyponepium. Oh, so you have your here. epinepium is here and your hyponepium is, is there. This, and so part. that should be the length of where your nails should stop. You so should this, not have any free edge here. That's pretty good. You're, that's you're, pretty, that's good. pretty good. I, yeah. Those ain't too bad, though. Yeah, but they're a little longer. Because you know the people be having nails Yeah, they like had this a, here. Yeah. So those are not good right now during this time of the coronavirus. You might want to take a moment to just shorten your nails again as a surgeon will wear their nails going into surgery. It should be a hyponepium Monday. Yes. <laughs> of the day. Here we Use go. it in a sentence. Yes. If you can. Hello, someone. All right. And of course, we've been hearing this. J don't touch your face. Do not touch your face. <laughs> so live, all the kisses. You see how we came out. You know we love each other. We were like, hey, sis, what's happening? That's how you do it. All your people, even your loved ones. Okay? I'm kissing Bond. Okay, well okay, that's good, baby. Yeah. That's your man. Yeah. Uh, of course, you got the mucus <laughs> membranes, nose, mouth. All of those are susceptible, obviously, mm -hmm. to germs. So just as much as you can. Almost play a game at the house. Try not to touch your face. Yeah. All right. I have a little bit of trivia knowledge. What do you have? Well, I was watching the movie Contagion, and it said that you touch your face two to three thousand times a day. A day. Wow. Wow. Just doesn't day. seem like that much. Though. I know, yeah. but it's your it's your person. Yeah. It's your body. You touch it. You don't think so, about it. I don't know. Don't little scratch. Little touch. When you got on makeup, you're very conscious about touching your face. Yes. So that, that kind of stops you. Right. That is true. Mm -hmm. You got a good one. Let Leah. me cut the numbers I got in half. Uh -huh. Okay. Mm -hmm. What did the yep. doctor say? The doctor said. Oh, he said. Dr. Day Dr. said. Dr. Day said, cover your cough, sneeze, then clean what you covered with again. Mm -hmm. So that means if you do your hands, of course, wash your hands. Mm -hmm. If you do your sleeve, he said, chances are that it, the virus can last up, up to 24 hours on any surface. Mm -hmm. So just that means even your down. sleeve. But what if you just do like, because I was thinking about that, like, man, but I'm in the house, I'm going to be take, changing my clothes all day. What if you do like just paper towel? Yeah, or tissue of some sort. Of some sort. Yeah. Of some sort. Yes. Well, we yes. have one more from the good doctor. Okay. okay. He says to avoid mm -hmm. large crowds. Yes. That's easy. Mm -hmm. It is your family. This, this is what he said. It is your family that is most at risk when you still go to the club <laughs> and then come home where older parents and grandparents may be. Yes. Although kids may not become ill from COVID-19, they pass viruses on better than most. All right. Mm -hmm. Well, thank you so much to the good Dr. Dave for sending us all this valuable information. Absolutely. Be sure to follow him on the gram at the good Dr. Dave. He posted a podcast there about coronavirus. Up next.